gosh. I'm literally so stuffed. Like, I cannot take one more bite. I will literally throw up. You barely ate anything, but okay. Yeah, I know. I'm just so petite and little. Like, look at my wrists. They're so fragile. You can literally put your whole pinky around them. Hey, I said you can put your pinky around my wrist, not, like, hold my whole hand. I don't know what you're trying to do, but this is a first date. I'm going to need a box. Thank you. You're going to, like, literally feed me for a whole week because there's no way I'm going to be able to finish that side salad. Like, it's going to take me, like, a whole week because, you know, I'm so, I'm so teeny. I just want to let you know that I didn't even do my hair or makeup for this date because I feel like so many other girls are so fake. And I want you to know what I actually look like. I mean, you definitely did your hair and makeup, but... No, this is natural, and I'm just wearing chapstick. It's kind of cold in here. Can you give me your hoodie? Let's go get our shoes. Wait, you actually think I'm going to put my feet in those nasty shoes that everybody else wears? Have you never gone bowling? Okay, yes, I've been bowling before, but I thought you'd be a gentleman and get me brand new pair of shoes. But it already shows how much you really care about me. Oh, I no, didn't No, it's fine. Know. I'll just wear the shoes that everybody else wears because I guess I'm just like everyone else to you. My shoe size, um, child size 13. Are you sure that No, your feet I are... literally have really small feet. Now go get the balls or whatever. Okay. Can you actually get me a size nine in women's? Wait, what? What? I didn't say anything. Here's our bowling balls. Mine's the orange one? Yeah. Is there a problem? Uh, do you not listen when I Snapchat you that my favorite color is pink? It isn't orange? No, it's because it's the lightest one. Oh, so you think I'm weak too? Chetty Chad? What now? No, 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 no. Don't give me that tone right now. I have something very important to ask you, and you're being literally so hot-headed. You're just like your dad. I mean, I met him last week, and literally, I can see you're just like him, and we need to cut that pattern because I'm not going to be like your mother. What is that supposed to mean? I mean, she has so many wrinkles. I cannot handle all the stress, so we need to cut the pattern just like I said. You have something very important to ask me. What do I need to ask you? course you don't know what what is coming up in a few days chatty chad oh uh, don't tell me it's your birthday or something no it's valentine's day and you haven't asked me to be your valentine yet you're my girlfriend so i mean so what that i'm your girlfriend i need to be asked personally what was so much fun i know <gasps> i forgot the key no you didn't i have it oh no the key won't work turn the key the other way whoops who are you Chetty Chad, why haven't you been answering my calls? I'm sick. You're sick? Let me hear. What do you mean, let you hear? Cough in my ear or something so I know that you're sick or sniffle. <laughs> oh, poor baby. Do you want me to get you something? What sounds so good to you? Because I'm just a good girlfriend and I'll get you something. What about chicken noodle soup? No, I'll have McDonald's. You want McDonald's? Are you really that sick? What do you mean, am I really that no, sick? I'll get it for you. I'll get it for you because you're my baby kins and you are sick. What is your temperature? Is your mother taking care of you properly? Is she taking care of you properly? Yeah, she's my mom. Can I, can I talk to her? No. Excuse me. Can you make sure it has pickles on my Sammy for my Chatty Chad because he loves pickles on his Sammies? Chatty Chad, I'm here. Come get your Sammy. Here you go. Bro, it has pickles on it. You know I hate pickles. What do you mean it has pickles? Why am I on this side of the street? Because you're for the streets. <gasps> that is not why. Oh my gosh, you don't know the sidewalk rule. Did your dad not teach you anything? Oh, right, that's because he walked out on you and your mom. Well, it's not my place to teach you every little thing on how to treat a woman like a queen. I swear, I'm always begging for, like, the bare minimum with you. Like, it's literally ridiculous. I'm going to give you a pass because you have your, like, daddy issues or whatever. But I'm not supposed to stand on this side of the road. Why? Because I can't be hit by, like, a bus or something. So you need to stand here. So I can get hit yes, by those? Yes, so you can protect me. Have you not watched a rom-com? Oh, wait, yeah, you know you haven't because every time I ask you to, you don't want to watch it because you're not interested in that. Well, am I interested in Spider-Man? No, I'm not, but I watch it for you because I love you. You do? But I don't anymore because you don't know nothing. You don't know anything. <laughs> hi. Uh, hi. You must be new. I'm Chloe. Nice to meet um, you. This is Lillian. And this is Keila. And um, you're kind of sitting at our table. Oh, I'm Look, sorry. it's literally fine. Isn't it fine, girls? Even though she's in my seat. And, um, you know, I'll just pull up a chair for myself. Because I want us all to sit together. Because 
you are literally gorgeous. Isn't Thank she you. gorgeous, girl? Yes, yeah, so gorgeous. Gorgeous. Yeah. So you're definitely going to be our friend. Um, a little annoying girl named Jessica is probably going to come in here in about five seconds and try to introduce herself and be a go-getter and annoy the heck out of you. So um, just warning you now, don't be friends with her. She's totally fake. Also, that's Chad over there. He's my boyfriend, so don't even try. I know he's super cute, so think the thoughts in your head. And you're definitely going to try out for cheer. I know the cheer coach, she loves me. So you'll definitely get on. Um, I'm sure you'll have to practice a little bit, but you're cute, so it's fine. And you're going to eat lunch with us, so welcome to the school. No, did you see Kayla's boyfriend liked my Instagram picture? He just like totally cheated on Kayla, but maybe I'll date him and Chad. Hey guys, let's not talk like that. You know Kayla's one of your best um, friends. Wow, Jessica. I didn't know you were in this conversation. Did you, Lily? No, I didn't. Yeah, that's because she's not. Why don't you mind your own business? Uh, Kayla's my friend, so I'm going to stand up for no, her. No, Kayla's not your friend, so don't need to worry about it, okay? Also, Jessica, uh, didn't you wear that outfit yesterday? No, I didn't. Uh, yeah, you did. You wore that exact hoodie and leggings. Yeah, I saw her in that outfit, too, yesterday. Mm -hmm. I have duplicates of my clothes, you guys. Don't you lie. I'm not. Ew, you guys. Jessica's must. Ooh, Jessica, ew. ew. yeah, you guys, she wore that exact same outfit yesterday. And she smells. Lily, give me that perfume. I have a thing called a washer. Yeah, but knowing you, you probably didn't wash those. Good morning, Chatty Chad. Oh, uh, why do you look like that right now? No, you do not get the audacity to ask me why I look like this right now. Actually, you know why I look like this right now? It's because I was up since 3 a.m. putting Easter baskets together for all my friends and including you like I'm somebody's mother. And I didn't get to do my 10-step skincare routine last night because I was doing that instead. So that is why I look like this this morning. And you know what? I don't appreciate that I am always giving to everyone I'm my time, my energy energy my money you mean your mom's money okay so what if it's my mom's money at least i'm spending it on other people that is like what jesus would want you to do and it's easter so then i drove the easter baskets over so you guys would have something to wake up to in the morning you mean your mom drove so what chad my mom drove the Easter basket. So what? what? What are you not understanding about the story? Just listen to the story, okay? And then I took a picture on Snap showing you that I put your Easter basket on your front porch and you were, did not wake up because I'm sure you were playing video games. And then I talked to your mother because I was like, well, at least I'll get my Easter basket. And she told me, you did not make me an Easter basket, did ya? I didn't think couples did that. Like, it's really just not serious at all. How is that not serious? We are dating. So I took my Easter basket back. That's why you don't have it on your front porch if you were going to go look. Um, it's no longer there because I took it back because you just don't care about me. So I'm going to eat your candy and I'm going to get fat and I'm going to cry about it. But you know what? What? I'm going to break up with you then? Huh? I'm going to eat your candy and I'm done with you. I already said that. Hey, Jack, come here. Uh, You're taking Instagram pictures of me. Why? Because people are going to think we're on like a cute little picnic date. It's going to be the cutest thing ever. I'm even going to put the caption that my boyfriend got me flowers when I literally picked these out myself. Why can't you have like one of your little friends like Lily take these? Did you not just hear me, you idiot? Because Lily's going to know you didn't pick these flowers out for me. So I want everyone to think that I have a great boyfriend. The least you can do is click a button. Can you tell me shoot for me? Can you not do anything for yourself? Why are you literally such a bad boyfriend? And hold the phone better. Oh my gosh. Wait, wait, I'm just hiding. You have a pretty hot girlfriend. You should be so lucky. Okay, here's your wait, phone. Chad, you have to keep tapping the button. You don't just take two pictures. Gosh, little idiot. And then I'm going to need your phone after this so I can put a perfect comment. I mean, I can comment myself. No, because the hard eyes are not going to just work, Chad. Now let me see the phone. Okay. Don't make me look fat. I mean, the camera picks up what it sees. You better knock it off. Hi. hi. Grandma made. Yum, pop it chocolate. I love these. Whoops, I mixed them up. Here you go. Wow, look how cool mine looks. Mine's kind of small, and it's a vitamin. I can't everything, anything go my way. I look a little busted this morning, but it's literally fine. Everything's fine. I have my Stanley, and we're going to go on a hot girl walk.
a little bit of a dilemma. So apparently my besties Lily and Kayla are both busy today. So my only other option is to go hang out with Jessica. So I have to go bribe her with Starbucks. So let's go to Starbucks. Also, for all the haters saying that I'm too young to drive, I literally have my permit. So shame on you. And I'm not even driving my mom because I can do that. I don't care. I'm literally going to be famous. Y'all are just jealous. Jessica, here's your Starbucks, you little rat. Take it. Do you think I care? It's a better milk for you. It'll make you, like, skinnier. I'll Why are you guys literally blowing up my phone right now? Aren't you going to pick us up? Oh, yeah, I'm not picking you guys up for school. Wait, why? Because it's finally hot outside and I'm not sitting in a stuffy classroom all day. My mom said it'd be better for me to stay outside and get the sunshine because literally it would be so bad for my mental health to, like, sit in a classroom all day. You know what? So I'm just doing things that are going to make me happy. And then I also want to go to the mall to get, like, one of those little Lululemon bags so I could be, like, that girl. But, I mean, sitting in the mall or whatever is, like, It'll, like, burn some calories and stuff like that. So, I think shopping is really good for me. Um, maybe you could do that, Jessica, because you're always at school. You literally have a perfect attendance, and maybe that's why you're, like, getting cankles. Because you're just sitting all day. It's, like, not good for you. Anyways, uh, my mom got us tickets to go to Coachella. Oh, my gosh, really? <laughs> Jessica, don't sound so excited. Everyone but you. I don't know why you're always on this call. And I'm not picking you up for school anymore when I do go. So, figure it out. But see you guys later. Okay, girlies, we're going to the gym. Why? Um, we need to get our hot girl bodies for the summer. Anyways, Jessica, yeah. did you already have your membership? No. Oh, my gosh, you idiot. I told you to get your membership a long time ahead of us. Why? Because you're not going to get your hot girl summer body. Why wouldn't I get mine? Because me and Lily and Kayla are just really petite already, so all we have to do is some toning, so by summer we'll be literally perfect if we start now. But you needed to start, like... I don't know, maybe last summer? Oh my gosh, Chloe, you're being rude. I am not being rude, Lily. Anyways, whatever. We can put you in like a one piece, make you feel good about yourself. Excuse um, me? So we can all be hot girl summer ready for my pool. Your pool. Well, I guess Jessica's pool, but Who said you were it's invited? Fine. Um, if you guys don't have a Stanley, you're going to have to literally go a couple blocks down on the treadmill for me because I can't. And look at my little lemon bag. Wait, isn't that mine? I left it at your house and you said you couldn't find it? No, Jessica, you literally... No, I bought this. Gotta know exactly who you are. Lord, have mercy. We must stay focused, brothers. We must stay focused. Ah. <laughs> Fucking punk ass bitch. You must think that you must you must think that shit sweet. You must think I'm one of them sucker white boys, you fucking goofy. Well, took you long enough. I think I should take you outside and teach you a lesson for mugging me off and make me look a cunt in front of my fucking pals. <laughs> You have failed, master. <laughs>